In this video, we are looking at the behavior exhibited by the Zenaida asiatica, commonly known as the white-winged dove. Specifically, we will take a look at aggressive behaviors towards others exhibited in the presence of food. Several hypotheses can be formulated in order to analyze this specific behavior. As we can see here, when there is competition for food, the white-winged dove engages in behavior known as wing slapping and direct flights in order to displace other individuals. Wiley 1991 classifies wing slapping as aggressive and confrontational behavior in Zenaida dove. He describes this behavior as an individual raising one wing and quickly flicking it out at another bird, or less commonly, both wings simultaneously so one wing makes contact with the opponent as the birds confront one another side by side. When analyzing the behavior from a functional standpoint, we can hypothesize that the aggressive behavior in the white-winged dove can ensure better access to food. To emphasize this point, we turn to Quinard and Sazely, 2012, in which they emphasize this concept in saying that intruders generally experience a lower feeding rate than territory owners, and even when undetected by owners, tend to limit the visit of a territory to a brief period of time. We can see that there is one dove who is trying to assert its dominance over the others in the area, suggesting that it's trying to claim this specific location as its own to ensure access to the food resource currently at hand. After initial observation of this aggressive behavior, someone might wonder what biological components are involved in this process. We can hypothesize that similar to humans, there is a specific region of the brain that, when stimulated, results in aggressive behavior. This idea was studied by Hardwood and Bowles, 1967, in which they found that simulating the midbrain region in ring doves increased the occurrence of behaviors such as wing slapping, wing raising, and wing fending. With this in mind, we can see that the white winged dove in the video is engaged in these same behaviors, which suggests that competition for food resources has evolved as a trigger that stimulates the same anterior midbrain region. Lastly, we will theorize how the behavior itself evolved. Since we are observing the behavior in an urban setting where the food was provided for the animals, we could hypothesize that the white-winged dove chooses different territories to defend based on opportune reliability of food. Goldberg, Grant, and LaFay, 2001, suggest that aggression levels in Zenaida dove increased with temporal predictability and clump spacing of food. This study suggests that white-winged dove have evolved to be plastic in deciding which territories are cost-effective to defend. When a resource runs out in one location, the white-winged dove will venture out to locate a new territory with adequate resources. So as you can see, there are several levels of analysis that can be used to dissect a single behavior.